what I ate in a day. I started with my regular half calf and with Trader Joe's soy creamer because I'm addicted to coffee. And then I tried to be a little bit healthier this morning. Instead of just eating bread with something on it, I ate oatmeal with something on it. I had oatmeal, kind of like an oatmeal bowl, you know, like an acai bowl, but instead oatmeal and with some granola on top and some blueberries. And this was quite delicious. A couple hours later, I was starving. And who doesn't love a sandwich? This is some Trader Joe's sourdough bread. That white stuff is tofu, just regular plain tofu, which I like. I don't know. It doesn't taste like anything, but it's good when you mix it up with some vegan mayo. I put some tomatoes in there. I put some jalapenos, the Trader Joe's sweet and spicy jalapenos chopped up, some red onion, and some spinach, and this was so good. And after that sandwich, I kind of wanted something sweet, so I basically made a smoothie, a kind of a thick smoothie, with one banana, some blueberries, a little bit of spinach, and some soy milk. And I ate it kind of like a soft serve kind of ice creamy kind of thing. Then I got hungry in the afternoon, and I had a little tiny bit of french fries left in the freezer, so I heated those up and I made a sauce dipping sauce with some vegan Trader Joe's mayo and the jalapeno juice, sweet and spicy jalapeno juice from Trader Joe's. And that was so good. I just sprinkled a cayenne pepper on the top and it was delicious. And then I made the cornbread from Trader Joe's mix, substituting the egg with a flax egg and the milk with soy milk. And this was good. I had a little nibble of that. And then for dinner, I made a chili with black beans, lentils, red onion, some frozen vegan um, meatballs from Trader Joe's, and some leftover tomato sauce, and threw some cornbread on top, and that was so good, and that was a complete day of eating.